So all I'm going to say is it's been a really rough week and just watch and you'll see for yourself as I attempt to complete the heroic miracle event just needing one light hero summon. So let's see if Lady Luck will shine on me again or if I'm going to waste all those resources for nothing. So my little heroic miracle adventure actually didn't start off on too bad of a foot. Quite the contrary, I I started off with some heroic summons, um, and I've actually, as you'll see, I went through and I got uh, a few five star heroes. Which getting any five star heroes is really lucky um, for me. I've had times where I've spent I think around 90 heroic summon scrolls and didn't get any five star heroes so as you can see I got a few there um, so any five star heroes is really uh, a good feeling and I could always use fodder so that's really um, never a downside and I actually did I had a pretty good amount of heroic summon scrolls uh, saved up I think I had about a hundred and fifty total um, nothing amazing nothing to write home about um, but it's still it still is a, a pretty good chunk of chunk of heroic summon scrolls to get some fodder for three four and five star heroes um, and I will say though the heroic summon uh, event is absolutely in my opinion unattainable uh, without spending money I would I think I did the math I'd have to skip like four or five events um, and that was cutting it close just to get somewhere near a high tier reward but regardless so from my initial from my initial heroic um, summons um, and a few others I was able to get um, two of the two of the six quests completed and as you can see I got some rewards and was able to get a cruise so I am really pumped because I'm already have I'm pretty sure a six star cruise and I need um, I really wanted to get that heroic miracle, so that'll be another one. So I'm really, really close if I can complete the heroic miracle to getting a 10 star uh, cruise. And as you can see there, I went to the altar and I purchased the dark erythanol to get uh, to complete my um, dark uh, hero summon quest. And now you can see this is where my decision quality started to tank. Um, I had, as you can see, I had a good bit of extra heroics or profit orbs, so I decided to try to spend some um, and see if I can create uh, a hero. And as you can see, I'm kind of close. And as you can see, I'm rushing through. I'm trying to find, uh, spend a little bit of guild coins, trying to go through and find. Uh, something that I could do to get a another five star and as you can see I was able to get one uh, divine spirit but this is where I probably should have evaluated and said hey after spending all of those resources I am still one whole light hero away um, I'm hoping to get lucky obviously I didn't so I'm still one hero away uh, what I'm gonna do now is go and try to get as many four star um, hero shards as possible because now I'm kind of in I don't know what it was but I am in the I am going to get Cruz and complete this uh, heroic summon event no matter what and as you can see out of all of those I didn't get one I didn't get one light four star hero um, now I'm going to I'm doing everything I'm going to friendship summons I got one divine spirit which was good um, and I'm just using every resource that I can um, going through cleaning out and I do this over and over and over again so heroic summons anything um, I would go through and summon and then clean out the trash um, sometimes getting rid of some three star light and dark heroes which I usually don't like doing too much of just to make room to keep going um, now it's time for me to go to my basic summon scrolls built up and as you can see I keep getting um, four star dark heroes I have a, 
a plethora of those. I could probably make two more dark heroes because I have one to summon and I think I can refuse one as well. So going through, I, I keep running into the the my max hero limit. And as you can see, I, I cut that part out. I didn't want to show you me get me going through the same thing, altering heroes every time. But I literally went through all those resources. I'm pretty sure I went to the Aspen Dungeon and was able to purchase five more heroic scrolls. Um, got a few more heroic or a few more hearts. Um, a few days, a day or two, I think, passed. So I got a few more hearts. Still nothing, so I have to kind of curb the downside, so I'm a little mad at this point. So really, I, I put this tech into the assassin tech tree because I was about, I knew if I didn't and I wasn't able to get one more or a few more four star light heroes that I would have spent the guild tech that I should be spending on, or guild coins that I should be spending on tech, on um, refreshing the guild store for 20,000 guild coins, and then purchasing a few of the um, Fagans. So instead, I also I need a little more uh, positive boost, so I'm going to go and first 11 star my Blood Blade, and then 12 star just to get some more hero progress I just needed I had to, I made two more uh, nine star food heroes and I wanted I wanted to put them to use I needed I needed a little bit more good and a little more happiness positive positivity um, to kind of brighten this day because I am I don't know why I was so dedicated and driven but I wanted to finish this heroic miracle event so literally I I made some tried to save my guild tech from being wasted um, got my um, got excuse me 13 or 12 star blood blade and now went through and I'm spending even more <laughs> of my profit orbs and it is just not going going too well I wasted mm, I wouldn't I'm about to I think 20 20 to 27 profit orbs trying to get a light hero as you can see it looks pretty good I got a few um, a pretty good amount of, of four star light heroes so looking um, we're gonna see um, and I'm just like okay I need a few more um, so what I ended up doing is waiting trying to see if I could get more um, more heroes from just the the summons and I still couldn't so I am now digging in literally going through 115 is like was the max if I start spending too much more I literally run the risk of not being able to complete the profit orb event so I'm running out of options I literally am gonna go and refresh the altar shop for 5,000 stones which is huge hoping to get a few Fagans and I only can get one I am just like burying myself digging myself like a 20 foot grave but out of nowhere lady luck I spent one more profit orb um, the next morning and literally got a four star Fagin from that out of nowhere so lady luck is literally saving me again and I don't know why but after spending all those resources just putting one more in I was able to get a five star Fagin and that was a roller coaster. I'm very lucky that I didn't waste all that for nothing. But EM Parallax here and remember, it's all about how you look at things.